All right, good morning, y'all. Day two. Welcome to the vlog. It's Rachel J. Let's get into the intro. Joy, 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 down in my heart. Where? Down in my heart. Where? Down in my heart. I got the Tell me what track you're in without telling me what track you're in. <laughs> me, me, moo. <laughs> Tell me what track you're in without telling me what track you're in. Uh, uh, yeah. Y'all not gonna do music track like this at all. Tell me what track you're in without telling me what track you're in. The book of Isaiah says, Behold my servant, whom Come I uphold. My yeah. chosen in yeah. whom my soul yeah. delights. Hello. Yeah. I have put my yeah. spirit upon you. Oh, I Not even the first. Ah, he will bring forth Glory. justice yeah. to the nations. Yeah. So I just come here to let you know that when you accept <laughs> the Holy Spirit, he will bring justice to you, to your family, justice. and to Hello. the nations. Justice. But it will be through you in time. Jesus' name. Every, in Jesus' every name. Time. Josh, look at Josh's plate. It's in my plate for a reason. <laughs> look at Asia's plate. Asia's plate, she eating good. Hey y'all, good morning, good like guys. Good morning. I like talking to everybody. I'm about to say, you guys are good. But he's going towards us. Praise the Lord! Hallelujah! Hallelujah! We're us praising the Lord! On the way. On the way. My name is Bryce. If you're looking at this, I was a ratio financial coach, and I'm the reason that he's here. Hallelujah. I'm just kidding. Ah. It's God. Ah. It's God provided the breakthrough. Amen. Indeed. We're going to get this first session started. And will. And will. And I don't know what's happening, but we about to be lit. My sis here. Yeah, I don't know. I saw a camera. I just and she's like, I just woke yeah, Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh.
hold it, hold it. California. Oh, I knew I was making it. Is it really going to happen? Who kind of felt like you were internally, you gave up like maybe like 10 times along the journey? Come on, let's be honest. Okay. Four. Okay. <laughs> you guys are awesome. Well, we're so pumped you made it. This is like favorite time of the year, all together, dreaming together, believing God for the craziest, outlandish things in our generation. It's going to be next level. We're going to have so much fun. Um, and I just, I gotta say off the, off the, like right here out of the gate, it's not going to be like, these five days aren't going to be normal. Like they're, these, these aren't going to be normal, like business as usual days. I don't, I, I don't know you yet, but my hunch is that you didn't raise the money, leave your friends, your family, your job, whatever you were doing, you didn't leave all that stuff to just come and hear a few good messages, meet some nice people, get a pat on the back, and then go home and live like you were before you came. Right. I, I right. know that's not in your heart. Yeah. I already feel it. Yeah. And the reality is you're gonna hear some good messages. You're gonna meet some incredible people. You're gonna get a pat on the back. You're gonna get a good job, thumbs up, thumbs up. You know, like all that's gonna happen. But that the reality is that Jesus has scheduled a meeting with you. Jesus is, he's made an appointment for you. Your name is, he filled it in. There's a time slot here and Jesus wants to say some outlandish things to you. Yeah. And he knew, check this out, he knew that he had to get you out of your current context. Yeah. And bring you into a place where you felt a little unfamiliar, a little left-footed where you felt a little bit more dependent on him and then in that moment he says now you have ears to hear now you have eyes to see so this week i want you to i want your expectation to just to it's already there but we gotta we gotta get it up yeah because the lord didn't bring you here not to say something wild to you right he didn't bring you here so that he could just be silent and you just go back like man that was confusing no this week is about clarity from heaven landing on your life yeah yo like this is so powerful so powerful so powerful there's power in exhortation there is power in exhortation there is power in exhortation. There is power in community. There is power when people come together and get the word, get knowledge. And not just, not worldly knowledge, but spiritual knowledge, Father. Thank you, Father, for an opportunity for us to grow together. Thank you for an opportunity for us to be in the community together in the name of Jesus. Thank you for the opportunity for you to choose us and not us choose you. <laughs> Anytime we think that you choose, that we're choosing you, it, <laughs> that's a trick because you actually chose us. So thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father, for this opportunity. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. Thank you for this opportunity, God. I mean, all right, y'all. So we're out of our first two sessions, and now we're going to lunch. I'll show you where we're going. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna get to eat. But we're gonna go, go stop by Routes, which is basically Kroger over here on the West Coast. Um, and yeah, I'll keep you updated. There was like restaurants over there, but I'm gonna see if I can get some like California, California energy. Cause I don't want to eat something I've ate before. 
All right, y'all, so I'm going to this place called Crack Shack, which is very much a weird name. However, a few of us are going, so I might as well go. Um, yeah, I'll show you the location when I get there. I just gotta pay attention to this road. But there's a lot of uh, different restaurants over here. There's a Target over here. Um, we just left Ralph's, so, um, yeah. And that's where we gotta meet back up. So I guess we'll meet up at Ralph's again later with other people. But right now, they have so many burger spots here. Burgers must be a big thing here. I'm not sure. I'm not picking up what they're putting down. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, y'all, there's definitely something prophetic about uh, being in Cali. This is about to be the second Tesla I done rode in. And this one is the sister to Atronis. <laughs> and it's a black interior. Won't he do it? I mean, yeah, he said, I mean, the music. I mean the, the, you ain't had to call him out like that. <laughs> like, they, they put him on. They put him on. They put him on. Wow. How dare you? You know, I respect it. I respect that's, it, but don't stop the music. Right. And that's the too. That's crazy. Wait. <laughs> Mine was so good. Yes. 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 Okay, who's like stoked out their minds from music track? Yeah! That was a powerful response. I love the gifs and the gifs, gifs, whatever, whatever you call them. Love those. The My favorite was the pig with the pinwheel. Whoever did that. Power to you. So fun, you guys. My name is Lena. I'll be kicking off music track today. And we just want to start by just getting to know you guys a little bit. I know we have a couple of stragglers coming in, so we bless them as they come. But thank you guys for being on time. Um, what did you guys get for lunch? We'll start with that. Just yell it out. Yeah. Kama, Kings, yeah. Sushi, yeah. Danes, Crack Shack, yeah. Hot Chicken, <laughs> Powerful. <laughs> crazy hey, crack have snacks for lunch? Crazy. And I'll eat a meal after this. And that is valid. And that is valid. Thank you. I yes. Yeah. This is fun. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Okay, yeah. amazing. So fun. Okay, first, can you just turn to your neighbor and look at them and say, hey, you're meant to be here. Hey, you're meant to be here. Awesome. Hey, you're meant to be here. Turn to your other neighbor and say, hey, you're also meant to be here. You're also meant to be here. That's good. That's really good. I love it. Okay, well, we just want to get 
get to know the room a little bit, so can you raise your hand for me if you play an instrument? It can be guitar, piccolo. Wow. wow. That is stunning. That's a lot. Look at, okay, keep your hand up if that instrument is acoustic guitar. Perfect. Raise your hand if you play electric guitar. Yes. Bass. Good, good. Uh, keys. Perfect. Drums. Piccolo. I played piccolo in middle school. Trumpet. Cello. Wow, okay, trumpet players in the back. Uh, raise your hand if you sing. Singers. Yes. That is what we like to hear. Raise your hand if you're a worship leader. That's a trick question. Everyone in this room is a worship leader. Raise your hand if you're a worship leader. I'll better see your hand. Powerful. Okay, can you raise your hand if you uh, lead worship on like a weekly basis? Perfect. Raise your hand. Keep it up if that's in a church setting. Like Sunday morning setting. Okay, raise your hand if you play in like a youth group or an adults group. Leading worship, playing instrument. Perfect. Um, can you raise your hand if you're a college student on a college campus? Yes. Okay, shout your campus. Let's see if I hear any of them. UCSD. UGA. I heard strawberry, which is probably UGA. not what you said. But. <laughs> Go dogs. Oh, go dogs. Amen. Okay. Um, last question is shout to me where you're from. Atlanta. Yes. Heard them all. That was good places. Very good places. So fun, you guys. Can we, can you do me a favor? If you are uh, CR Music staff in the room, can you please stand? Let's go. Can we give a round of applause for our Amazing. Guys, just look at these people for a second. These are the people that you want to go to in breaks and before and after session and be like, hey, can I pick your brain? Ask them any question you can think of. These are people you can utilize to learn from. They are legends upon legends upon legends. I couldn't recommend talking to them more. So just look at their faces real fast. Get a good look. They're beautiful people. That's powerful. Thank you, guys. You can sit down. So fun. Well, guys, we're just going to hop in. Does that sound good? Yeah. We'll hop in. So fun. Is it warm in here? All right, y'all. So we just got out of our um, our skill set tracks, and it was pretty. It was a lot of information, a lot of information. However, um, there was a lot of gems that were like impactful, and a lot of things you could take on with you, and stuff that you can study in your notes um, and get better on. I feel like I'm gonna have to meditate on things multiple times over on these notes because um, I feel like. Being a little bit tired will have me a little bit distracted, but I do know it's going to be an amazing thing once I apply the things that I've written down. Uh, Y'all, let's get on this first band, please. Yeah. It's all right. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> we're on our dinner break, so we're gonna we're gonna yeah. find something quick. We're gonna find something quick right. to eat. Some you got shot that. Go ahead, get it. All right, y'all, we're going to Burger Lounge. Apparently they have a plant-based option, which means this is the vegan food tour, extended edition. <laughs> oh, you're going to Hawaii? Oh, they cussing on the inside. You just lost two customers. I would have went with you. I saw the order. It said order F in here. I said, okay. <laughs> Alright y'all, so while we in the restaurant, I'm going to taste the fries. And y'all know I'm going to be honest. This is the texture. That's what's wrong. The texture is wrong. I mean, they could cook it a little, it's had a bit longer. It's still like 1% undercooked. Like 99%? Yeah. Look. <laughs> At least it's slightly seasoned. I taste a little bit of salt. The oil is fresh. Right here. We'll try the burger when we get to Kaba. Meet up with everybody else. But so far, it's pretty decent. <laughs> See, I, I've been trying to be nice. Oh. But yeah, you're right. It tastes in the texture tastes like the McDonald's chicken nugget. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Like the chicken. Okay. It's giving McDonald's chicken nugget. Um, you see how it's like, yeah. Can you hand over it? Oh. You know how it's hanging off there? So 
Yeah. Um, I would rate it um. Guys, I think okay. one out of ten. Okay. <laughs> when I get into the bed, you had one. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay. Yeah. I would have gave it a four. More salt. Okay. More salt. I give it a. Like a one. Is one? I, I gave it a three. Time. I gave it I a three. About 4 .5. Right. I feel like I've had worse fries. Yeah. I had worse than McDonald's. Yeah. Uh, Again, <laughs> I don't want no eleven million fries. <laughs> and then when it's bad, like no. Did you get food? Okay. All right, y'all. That's everybody. Do I have your Instagram? Huh? I don't have your Instagram. I don't think so. All right, y'all. So we about to go to Kava and meet up with everybody else. That's why I eat. I eat. Clean. I do. Yeah. All right, y'all. So we made it to Kava. Um, we already told you about the fries, and I'm in front of a pole, so just get a shadow for me. Great. So first off, this is giving definitely, definitely vegan. Impossible patty is definitely giving <laughs> impossible. I know they did not give us iceberg lettuce. I thought this was California. I thought this was California. California is all about health, evidently. Iceberg is just cheap. Oh, thank you, Father, for the food that we ate and that we're going to continue to eat. I bless the for nutrition and no harm in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hold on. It's good. I taste some char. Oh. I didn't expect that from the inside. I'm going to say that. Good thing or bad thing? That's a good thing. And then uh, the grilled onions? Mm. So I got a West a West uh, BL burger. It got uh, impossible meat, cheese. I think these are onion rings. Mm -hmm. Bacon, barbecue sauce. So yeah, mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh, this vegan cheddar cheese don't even taste vegan. That's good. I could have done without this lettuce though. <laughs> it's just adding water to the sandwich. Hmm? Yeah, for the good. Yeah. I'm about to, oh, are you recording? Mm -hmm. Oh, never mind. I'm going to talk to you. Look at this, pretty good. I feel like they got the same impossible patty from that Burger King guy. Cause this one is thin. Mm. Just like the Whopper. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not mad at it at all. You got that cooked it in barbecue sauce? And grilled it. Oh. Or they seasoned it with a barbecue seasoning. Or something, yeah. This is probably one of the best vegan burgers I've had. Mm -hmm. Out of like eight that I've had. From eight different restaurants. It's pretty good. But I kind of expect that. Yeah. I feel like Cali is like the vegan head state. <laughs> right. <laughs> they went to playing base out here. Alright y'all, so I'm going to go ahead and do the grading system. So we have, we grade on environment, um, service, uh, food, like flavor profiles and stuff like that. Um, 
or like comparison to other things out of 10. Um, what else is it? I think that's pretty much it. Well, you didn't eat the whole burger. I did almost eat the whole burger. <laughs> this thing is actually falling apart a little bit. Yeah, I was just stuck together a little bit better. Um, I might grade everything separately. Fries, I already said it is like a four. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the fries I are four. I'm not expecting that. It's kind of smoky and sweet mm. at the same time. It's probably gonna be my last burger for a little bit. Wait, how many burgers have you had today? No, this is my I first one. Be, I thought you were gonna get in hot some burgers. I did. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm over coming at you, my man. I like. Like this is a whole vegan, whole vegan meal. A whole one, not a half one. Look, I mean, they should have took the fries a little bit longer, like. Okay, huh? Just a little bit. They just need to let's tie it a bit longer. Mm -hmm. I'm like, I mean, yeah, I looked them in the bag. I'm like, they look cooked too. But I mean, they need to be a little bit crunchier and a little bit more cooked on the inside. Hmm? I guess. I mean, well, I didn't even know. Mm -hmm. Oh, environment, I'll give it a eight and a half. Um, service, what's a ten? Um, food, seven and a half. Yeah, food was a seven and a half. That's mainly because the fries are trash. Um, I said four. What was the fourth place? Oh, comparison to other things, out of all the vegan burgers, that fries combo, this probably be about, I say this every time, it's like number four. Behind Far Real Burger, uh, Good Ass Burger, and, no, it's number three. It's number three. I mean, oh, I forgot, I didn't even record that one. I ate the Red Robin vegan burger yesterday. It was just basic. Like, if you wanna have a vegan option, don't make it basic. It's disrespectful to the vegan. Right. It's basic and charged for up, like too much. That one, that, that burger was definitely like an eight. I mean, eighth place, that's what I meant. But it was an eight in flavor. I have to get a dress for Gabe and Michaela's wedding. No, I'm not going. I'm still gonna be here. And I served that day. You gonna be an usher? No, greeter, greeter. Yeah. I, I'm still an usher. My name is Usher. I can't do that. Y'all, we made it to the greenhouse. We made it to the greenhouse prayer room. Oh, good. And, oh, oh. Hey, it's gonna be exciting. It's gonna be lit. The way we got the doors to open was open the floodgates. Not gonna sing with me, okay? Ready? That's how we got how we got the doors to open. Open the floodgates of heaven. Let it rain. I can't hear my part. It's okay. It's okay. What happened was, we figured out our parts and the door is open. It is what it is. So yeah, this is gonna be great. This is gonna be great. All the people I'm normally, I see normally, who are staff are here. Prepare the way of the Lord, prepare the way of the Lord. Hey, prepare the way of the Lord. Oh, oh that be raised up on mountain. Be made low, yeah. oh valley. Be raised up, oh mountain. Be made low, oh valley. Be raised up, oh mountain. Be made low, oh valley. Be raised up, oh mountain. Be made low, oh Now you know that we can like that, because I'm a.
Oh, I don't know what y'all just saw, but I forgot I had a camera in my hand. I don't know if y'all really gonna experience what's happening here. We're about to take you the aftermath. Yeah, y'all might experience the aftermath, because I don't think I'm gonna record. So y'all, this is us after Greenhouse. After Greenhouse. Fresh out the Greenhouse. It's getting after Greenhouse. Run. You hear our voices? They're a little raspy. It's time to go to sleep. Um, but yeah, that's the end of day two. Um, are we doing after? You see, I had to put on my glasses, and the Lord make you a little bit blind if, after you receive some stuff that you don't know that you, you didn't think you could handle. So the Lord had to take my eyesight away just so he could show me something from behind the lens. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Okay. Guys, so we, we just worshipped Jesus, and it was fire. Yes. And we're gonna be back here in the morning. And we'll at 9 a.m. Uh huh. The shadows is coming at 8:30. Uh huh. And then what we're gonna do? We're gonna come here <laughs> on our face again. So yeah, that's the end of day two. Um, see you uh, tomorrow for day three. Um, it was an amazing day. A lot of new things. A lot of new things. Look at this crowd, y'all. Um, but make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with anybody, everybody. Follow me on Instagram at the Hero Shield J, and I'll see you in the next video. What's good? How's your day? What's good? It's your boy, Hero Shield J.